The independent senator Nick Xenophon says the family of Ian Humphrey is being kept in the dark about the handling of a complaint made to the Legal Practitioners Conduct Board. The complaint has been made against Eugene McGee, a lawyer who drove the car that crashed into and killed Mr Humphrey. Ian Humphrey was killed when a car driven by Eugene McGee struck him as he rode his bicycle on the Kapunda Road in 2003. Mr McGee, a lawyer, was acquitted of the charge of attempting to pervert the course of justice over his conduct immediately after the fatality. Di Gilchrist Humphrey has complained to the Legal Practitioners Conduct Board that Mr McGee's decision to leave the scene of the fatal accident amounted to unprofessional conduct. The board is an independent body that handles complaints about lawyers, but Ms Gilchrist Humphrey says it's secretive and inadequate. I guess I would just like the members of the board to be able to look at me in the eye and explain their reasons for their decisions, whatever that decision may be. A board spokesman has confirmed that the complaint will be considered tomorrow. He says the board doesn't hear submissions in person, but the complaint is receiving serious and considered attention. Senator Nick Xenophon, who's advocated for Ms Gilchrist Humphrey, says the board's deliberations are her last chance for justice. You know, there's a real test here whether we have a system in the state that keeps lawyers accountable or whether it's just a cosy club. The former Attorney General believes the case of Eugene McGee provides an argument to have fewer lawyers on the Legal Practitioners Conduct Board. I think there is a, a majority of lawyers in this case who are prevailing uh, over the non-lawyers uh, and uh, the values of our, uh, our society. That view hasn't gone down well with members of the Law Society who've branded it as populist. Chris McLaughlin, ABC News, Adelaide.